I make less teaching a class of 20 students than one student pays to take that course. We've been working this semester speaking to other adjuncts and discussing unionization and what that could bring for our profession. Uh, and we found we've had common concerns. We kind of come together and form more of a community, which is something that we've all felt lacking on campus. Uh, traditionally, adjuncts have been used as sort of substitute labor uh, or professionals that would come and teach one class and, and that would be a nice arrangement. But uh, m more recently, uh, adjuncts have been, it seems, have been used to cut costs and uh, more and more adjuncts are used because they can be hired cheaply and now a growing number of adjuncts have, 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 been, have been doing it for 10, 15, 20, maybe even 30 years and, 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 uh, and, that's, and, and it's not a very good living wage. Most universities today are not interested in adding to their roster of full-time professors so opportunities even to get onto that tenure track are fewer and far between than they were a decade or two ago. Part of it is, honestly, for some of us, that um, the independence of being an adjunct has certain attractions to us, but um, even though we may enjoy being part-time instructors, we still have had a full-time education to get here. Many of us have incurred full-time student debt to get here. And so we would still like to be paid a professional wage. Continuity. We're hired back year after year after year. But pay, obviously, many of us have not seen a pay increase in more than a decade. Uh, we're at a flat rate, and administrative uh, salaries go up, of course, and tuition goes up. So that's troubling. We're not a homogenous group. We have, many of us have different concerns, but among them are, yes, pay, uh, opportunity for professional development, equanimity, as I've just talked about, that's a very big key role for many of us, just having a voice.